Quebec gave the Algonquin Nation until tomorrow, April 15th, to take a good look at the agreement and principle they tabled earlier this month regarding moose hunting near their ancestral territory. Except the newly elected band council at Barrier Lake decided last week the proposed agreement was too limiting. And since then, more and more people are going on record to say council's holdout could compromise the whole deal. When the news came out with the public press release that was released from the Barrier Lake Council, uh, a lot of us felt very devastated, uh, disappointed, very sad because it was going back to something that was not working from the community. Shannon Chief is a member of the Wolf Clan of Barrier Lake. She's assisted in the on-the-ground demonstrations there for the last two years. And while newly elected Chief Tony Wawati agrees moose need protection, he wants to revive a previous agreement that protects against other exploitation on their territory. Community members say this decision to withdraw from negotiations was made too quickly. Uh, the youth are also taking a very big stand by uh, questioning the, the new leadership today. You know, what is the future going to be like? Are we going back to the trilateral agreement? Are we, uh, uh, what's going on at the Moose Moratorium? Why are you not signing it? And they're not really getting much uh, response uh, from the council in regards to that. We're not really brought into the little details, everything in between for the agreement. Alan Ratt was chosen to speak on behalf of the community's youth council. When they say something about the land, it's always don't sell out the land. And I think that's all that needs to be said. We reached out to Chief Wawati, but his stance remains the same even after a week of community meetings. Uh, for sure, I reached out to the negotiator and say, listen, the elders were saying, let's meet each other. Let's get an understanding. But let's take a look at what uh, what our elders worked on. You know, and, uh, and there needs to be a lot of education around that, uh, around uh, the implementation agreement. Chief says she hopes her community and the nation as a whole can find common ground, even if not ahead of Thursday's meeting with Quebec. Really divided our community and it divided our nation, so... We have very high hopes to kind of take this um, this uh, agreement in principle as a step to start rebuilding, you know, the nation as one. Lindsay Richardson, APTN National News, Montreal.